That was my feeling when uh, I went to San Francisco last week and I went to the Foundry and I'm like, I'll tell all my South Florida people. Oh, wait, they're adverses. Oh, wait, they're asleep. <laughs> yeah, yeah. One of the two. Okay, but we cannot sleep on the Wario. I actually like Wario on Smashville. I'm not sure how Elio feels about this stage, but you could I mean, consider striking that. It's probably just a gentleman to Smashville. Yeah. Oh, the bike! Oh! I think people should reconsider that against characters who are good at it, like Wario, Falcon, Ness. Cloud. It's some matchups. Okay, yeah, Elio had the right read. Uh, wanted the Tomahawk, but just ended up... Oh, oh, she tried to counter the bike, but it didn't work. Kind of just slid before the hitbox came out. Yeah. What? Wow. That, okay. okay, I like I it. Thought, I thought Snorly got bamboozled because the whiff recovery on uh, Corrin's counter is ridiculously low. She air dodged through, but... uh. Snorly had an option for that. Cool. Yes, finally got okay, got the Tomahawk. Fair into Oh, he tried to shield grab, but there's too much pushback. Nice double he's, fair. Works on Wario because he's one thick little midget. So Snorly's got all of these reads, and just the percent from each read is much smaller than Korn's. Alright, he's DIing away though, and tech rolling away. Uh, does not want to get uh, sweet spot side beat. <laughs> yeah, I think a run-up pin might have caught that tech chase, but uh she wasn't looking for that. She was looking for like a roll in or something. Yeah, I think Snorley's key here to victory is going to be getting Elio to roll out of panic and then uh, just jumping after her and getting something. And Snorley has some great roll reads. Like, you'll see some up smashes and wafts that. Not true, but oh, he doesn't it, care. Okay, that, up smash maybe? Would that work? I think it would have. Yeah, plus now he's a dangerous uh, forward throw at the ledge. He didn't grab out a shield the wrong way. He might have just missed the buffer. Let's go back here. Is, she, is it dead? Okay, Snorly All has right. got courage for doing that. He's got oh extra my. courage for doing that. That was unfortunate for Snorly. <laughs> got a little too aggro. He um, tried to punch a forward smash twice. This man is going in. It didn't work, but he's going in. <laughs> oh, and now Waft is on deck. So if he can just take the first stop. Just take the first stop. Yeah, he wants to and save that's it. Dead now, right? Fourth throw? Probably? Yes. yes. Okay. I was scared for a moment. We take that 1%. Yeah, charges up off, but he's got it, so. Lost her jump, but he can't really do much about that up B. Yeah, we haven't seen many uses of the command grab. <gasps> oh! Here it comes. Is he? Oh, he, he didn't believe. Up. He didn't believe. He didn't uh, think it would kill yet. Yeah, and she was going into the center, and across the stage, it definitely wouldn't have killed. And plus, you'd much rather get percent and save waft, and then, you know, be able to do an edgeguard setup with waft. If uh, Snorley got her for sure going outward, might have worked. Because Smashville is very close to the sides, the edge of the stage. Mm -hmm. Ooh, that was almost death. At least got to watch her cor uh, counters. Mm -hmm. Oh no, the bike. We know it's coming. We know it's there. Do not land with an aerial on the bike. Back throw? It okay, makes down throw. more lag. Don't do it. You almost did it. And plus it, ex it makes uh, Waft huge. Yeah, it makes Waft bigger, and you hitting the bike makes your thing have more lag, because it's busy like, bah, it's hitting it. All right, nice pin by Elio. Wants to take this stock as safely as possible. Don't stop countering. That was almost a Waft. Very scary. Almost. Mm -hmm. Oh. And they're both getting to the percents where a few more hits, and then their throws could actually threaten yep. taking the stock. Elio's got to be very careful how she gets up. Uh, she got it. Oh. Was it a bait? I don't think so. It's just he got the better end of that. All right, the good back kick. Would forward kick have done it? Um, it, w it wouldn't have hit, I don't think. Oh. And now I think Elio might be looking for a safe grab. Yeah. Yep, safe. Can't do anything about it. Elio has literally forgotten every move except for the two. <laughs> pin and grab, pin and grab. <laughs> she didn't neutral get up. He just, he just grabbed like a few frames too late. And that would have done it. Roll behind. Smashville, Rage, all the factors. Oh, no. Ah. Yeah. Snorley, seem, uh, Snorley seems pretty chill about it, though. He knew what he did wrong. He knew what he did right. And he almost got, like, the craziest punish ever. Yeah, he, he, just, he just pulled the trigger a little too hard. He would have been on some vines. And that feels good no matter what. Would have been called gluttony. Or, uh, gluttony. Gluttony. I like I'm French channel commentary. My inner oh yeah, French commentary is fantastic Fouster. because oh la 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 la. <laughs> oh la back air. Oh la for the waft. Okay, up tilt is huge. People who don't play uh, against Wario a lot, it beats everything. It beats yeah, everything. It just has some awkward end lag, right? Oh yeah. Uh, a lot of his, 
a lot of his big moves. But up up tilt is huge, so. And forward tilt's kind of like a smash tag, right? Yeah. It, I think it's better than forward smash in that it does around the same, has around the same killing power, and it's just faster and slightly larger. Yeah, so far, I think Snorley, though, is pretty wise. Oh. He knew it wouldn't have killed. That's very nice. Yeah, Snorley's pretty wise for not uh, trying to space a boxing match against Corrin. Oh, if you're a Wario main, you're a smarty pants. That's, that's just the rule. That did it? Oh. That did right. it. I didn't I, know down air sent at that kind of angle. She might have been trying to SDI out or like DI out of it or something and just held away. But down air is a pretty good kill option. Just I didn't think that early. Hmm. Oh, uh, spot dodges. All right. He was looking for that little extra punish instead of going for a grab. Didn't quite work out. And there's the tiny, tiny hitbox on there. It's very sad. Oh, finally using down smash. They're both missing a lot of each other's cross ups. Yeah. B reverse neutral B. Yep. <laughs> that was such a read. I can read Elliot's mind. And Nair missed again. He's gotten so many Nairs, and all of them have missed because the second hitbox is so tiny. Oh, it doesn't have a jump. She's okay. It's hard to interact with Corrin's up B sometimes. Well, as, as Wario, too. Yeah, I I have the same feel. Unless you Oh, that was almost a lock. If she rolled in, that that's what Snorley was looking for. That was going to be crazy. You gotta believe, Snorley. You just gotta believe. Or we'll do hop. the Jigglypuff thing of air dodge into you waft. Oh yeah, full hop, uh, full hop fair, full hop air dodge are definitely things you'll see Wario do all the time in neutral. Stop they're gonna kill. All right, there we go. If you stop and look for it, it's pretty easy to punish. But Snorley good cannot Wario's sleep yet. Um, has to save this waft, make it count. Yeah, and if you miss your waft, it's so demoralizing, and then you're on the mental backseat. Even if you had a lead. Yeah, and at that point, you kind of have to just count on winning more exchanges. Oh! And the percent is perfectly even after like a second. Oh, that was Elio. Why? That was that ain't right. Elio, s she did. Okay, self-described. These are Elio's words. Very greedy. So I agree. I'm also very greedy. And every once in a while, you forget that your character with an upward moving up B isn't Meta Knight, but you think you're Meta Knight, and then you do it, and then you die. And but you remember your Charizard. Everyone gets one. And yes, that's exactly yeah. that's that's the character. Believe in yourself, though. Like, Charizard, Corrin, Fox. I'm Larry, guys. What <laughs> was that a questionable decision? Absolutely. But did Elio believe in herself? Yes. She, she believed. That, she had that comeback looking clean up until that one moment. And you can fully charge. Oh, but now we're on battlefield. On other characters, you don't think you're gonna die at 66. Like that would have not lost the stock against anyone else except maybe Bayo. Um, anything with like an, any character with an insta kill, I guess. Yeah, Bayo, Ryu. Big punishes. Oh, all right. Yeah, I, it might have been a mistake by Snorley to let him go to battlefield. Uh, given this is kind of Corrin's broken on the stage. The Corrin's got a lot of good stages. She's got so many options, and different Corrin's will favor different things. Like FD, if she wins the neutral, she wins the neutral. Battlefield, she's got all this mobility. Town and city, she's got earlier kills. It's really hard to decide what to pick against her. Lilat, she covers the platforms with Nair. Not battlefield. I would prefer Battlefield to Lilat and Town and City against Korn. It might be a symptom of what Snorley feels comfortable on. Because Wario's shenanigans can be very speed dependent, I feel. And sometimes you want to camp, and platforms help a lot for that. So I think that's what he's going for. It's oh, just no. not working. Oh! The up angled tipper forward smash? Are you serious? I just watched the player cam as the life slowly <laughs> drained out of Snorley. His health bar went from like 84 to, to nothing. I was like, oh, what's she going to get? She's not in range for the side. Oh, oh, goodness. Okay. <laughs> but what you don't expect, another part of why Corn is broken. If you land on a platform, you might die. Oh, uh, never mind. Uh, stock for stock. That was very good awareness on Snorley's uh, you part. Said, you said something about roll reads, and I <laughs> came back to bite Elio right there. Yeah, that's what Snorley does. And even in the situation where he's getting, like, air dodge right all over, he didn't lose mentality. All right, but... Now he's in the kind of terrible situation of being down a lot uh, without waft. Yes. He probably wants to be able to live long enough to get another half charge. He can camp for a long time, but corin has got such powerful hits that it's risky just uh, dragging the game out. Yeah, so I want to see Elio make a lot of smart decisions and try to safely kill Snorley before he can get a half waft. Yeah, the safe way to play is just a few little hits and then an up throw. Mm -hmm. And it's getting close to that point. Oh, falling there, and it would have been the percent. 
Not quite. And All she right. didn't use up throw because she's not staling it. And we saw from previous games, that is Elio's game plan. Stab and throw. <laughs> Stab and grab. Oh. There we go. Stab. Oh, I like it. Yeah. I like it. But these back rolls, I feel like... Oh, never Stab. mind. Stab. <laughs> wow. Whoa. There was a scream somewhere and not from either of the players. We that heard was, that in here. That was Korn's death scream. That was Elio? Yes. Do you not hear her... That was the craziest. Yes. That was the pop.